For this exercise we'll paint a rainforest. I selected a colour, fellow green. So we'll put plenty of white on. The painting will go around here somewhere, about like that. I'm working on canvas, you might be working on a board. I'm going to paint on a little bit of fellow green, put it in there for a tint with the white. Crisscross it in to the, the fellow green. And not too dark, very, very pale. Let's stay very pale like that. Very pale. That's the way. And up in the corner a little bit more. And don't go back over your brush strokes with this painting. This is a painting that's in the bush, so therefore we, we don't really have any sky. Although there might be a little bit beaming through, and we are making it up as we go along. So that's our background. Like that, crisscross, crisscross, and leave those marks in there. And let's have a white bit there, and a white bit about here. There, so that looks like a nice background, something interesting. I'll fill in this bit up here. Now, I'll clean the brush down the bottom and have white so distance there. And I'll pick up the fallow green right across the bottom and crisscross it up into the white. Oh, finish the board off and make sure it's very dark at the bottom, as dark as we can get there and there and there. And with a fan brush, we can turn that into grass before we go too far. A little bit of grass here and there, like that. If you add a little bit of white, you can have a, a few little flowers. And a bit more dark. Across the other side, the same thing. Flowers. That's it. That's the bottom of our painting. Now here's a bit I really like. Load some fellow green on one side of your brush, and white on the other, so it's two colours. And across at your painting, Keep the white on the inside of the painting and paint in some tree trunks. Now, calm them down. We don't want them full colour. We want them rather muted, like that. And like that, another one. You see how it, how it gives you a tree trunk look? Because it's from light to dark. Everything's from light to dark in a painting. The other side, let's have our white on this side of the painting here. There. Not too dark. Not too dark and crisscross and a little one in there, in there, in there and a few tree trunks like that with your brush almost unloaded not much on the brush at all and I know in the bottom here it's really good to have a little bit of white just about there load the brush again and let's have some trees coming in here not parallel, that one was parallel so let's cut in with one say here, like that there and one coming from here, right across and into there, say, like that. Okay. Now with our little brush, loaded with two colours also, we can paint some branches there. Two fingers on your brush, and paint your fans just like that. Oh, that's a bit dark, that one, because this is the background, so we do want it pale. Keep it like that, and if you can, oh, that's too white, that one. Not too white either. There. So you learn to use your brush and, and relax and use it. Just pull it up into little tree trunks and things here and there. This is a jungle. And of course there'll be bits and pieces here. Let's put them in like that. And in here. Because that's the side of the picture, we can go darker. But keep your pails in the middle. Then I'll use the fan brush and pick up a few colours. And we can brush in a few ferns like this. That'll give us a ferny look. Not much paint on the brush, but keep them in like that. Don't try and make tree ferns, but also keep the good bits of your painting so you can see them. If you see something that's not so good, you can cover it over. Or something's a bit too dark, just dab a few ferns on. There we are, a few ferns here and there. And across the side there where that dark bit is, we'll make that look bushy there. Now we need to go back with our brush, clean the brush and load it with dark paint. Here we need a big tree. We might have to cross out some of our other trees. Let it come in there like that. In another one. Like that. And that one's facing out of the picture. Now let's bring it in with a branch across here. And I think we need one up the edge of the picture like that. Now we need pure white on our brush. And come down the inside of each of those. Turn your brush as you're going. 
and let it come off the edge like that. And down here, just one edge of the tree. And we'll whiten this inside edge here, which will attract the eye into the middle of the picture. And on the other side, we'll do the other side of this tree. There, clean the brush again. And we need to darken these very much. And this one, very dark. In the fork of that tree with a little brush again we can put some trunks in it doesn't matter where they go but try and keep the good bits of the background looking nice and this one into the picture bring him back into the picture into the picture there and one here say bring into the picture there and up into the picture there and I've loaded light and dark on there. The bits of bark hanging off here and there. And light and dark again. We have twigs laying on the ground. Make sure you keep the darks. Here with our fan brush again with a lot of paint on there this time. We'll have a few ferns. Just a few. And let them come down into the picture like that. And another one there. Now don't spoil your good spots, but you can put one coming into the good spot so you can get contrast between the lights and darks. There. And maybe a little one here. Careful now. You don't have to paint the whole fern. Just like it looks like there's a fern there. I think some more flowers are going to look nice there. And a bit of something up here to stop the eye travelling off up into the bush up the top. All the way around, say, we can have bush happening. Make a bit bigger picture. There. And of course, being a jungle, there'll be some vines hanging across. You can have vines like that. And one hanging down. Maybe twiddle up like that. And a piece hanging off there. And a branch there. And a few vines across the tree. So there's a very simple rainforest for you to paint. 